Hi everyone, John D'Amico from Golf Fitness Edge down here in Naples, Florida. I want to thank TPI for putting these great low equipment, no equipment exercises out on the web so you can get your workout in. These are some exercises that I do with my clients, my senior clients, to improve their cardiovascular fitness, balance, and movement control patterns. Now what we're going to do is we're going to start out with a walk for five minutes. We're going to start slow, move up to a more vigorous walk. Obviously you don't need to see me walking. Uh, oh, and by the way, uh, if you have not been exercising and you're over 50, check with your doctor first uh, because quite honestly, uh, we don't want you to get hurt. And as well, uh, hey, if there's an exercise that I'm doing here that you're a little unsure of, hey, use the I think I can, no, I better mantra, okay? Uh, modify down the exercise. Don't want to fall and break a hip all us old guys, right? Okay, so we're gonna start out with a five minute walk, make it a little more vigorous, and then we're gonna add in little exercises that you can do without equipment. First, we're gonna start with marching, and I'm gonna turn sideways to you here, because you can do your marching like this, which is great, but if you're able to, it'd be great if you could add a little balance component to that. So we kinda come up and hold, come up and hold, come up and hold, and you can do 10, 20, 30 steps of these. After you've done that, go back to walking for two minutes. You're going to walk for two minutes in between each of these exercises. After we get done with the two minute walk, we're going to do a little what I call retro walking. Retro walking, I learned from Greg Cook at the Grove Golf Fitness Summit of several years ago. I call it the John Wayne walking over the fence backwards. If you ran John Wayne's movie backwards, it kind of looked like this. Try to keep your pelvis straight ahead. Pick up your hips and roll those hips like that. Again, 10, 20, 30 steps. After that, walk for two minutes. Next, we're going to do side shuffles. Getting in that athletic posture, working that hip hinge, and we're going to shuffle back and forth. Every one of these 10, 20, 30, what you can do. Again, walk in between. Next is karaoke, and it's going to have a variation. So you can do your karaoke. All right, but how about this? We do a little karaoke, boom, we hold for balance. Boom, we hold for balance. Walk for two minutes. Next, one of my favorite exercises that I learned from Jason Glass, I call it the J Glass One, because it's the first exercise he taught me. It's a little Bulgarian split squat, squat with a little rotation. We're going to drop into a split squat, rotate to the front side, come up, rotate to the front side alternate, right? We're going to rotate to the front side, rotate to the front side. Only go as low as you're comfortable. Oh, by the way, spring allergies. I may sound a little nasally, a little short of breath, but I'm in fairly good condition. <laughs> now, um, boxer jabs. Now, boxer jabs, after you walk for two minutes after the J-glass, the boxer jabs, what we want to do is basically we're going to step, load, Pelvis, torso, arm. Step, load, pelvis, torso, arm. Five each side would be sufficient. Next is skipping. Now, skipping can be done a lot of different ways. And I'm going to show you some variants. It, you don't have to have a high amplitude on your skip, especially if you're older. And if you have a hip replacement, I might be reticent to do this, especially at a high amplitude, but basically skipping can be done forwards, it can be done backwards, it can be done in circles. The point is you can skip all over. Don't fall down. Walk for two minutes and then you're done. So it's about a 30 minute exercise. Hey, I want to thank you all for staying safe, staying vigilant, social distancing. Make sure you walk two minutes in between each of those exercises, get a nice 30 minute workout. If you need to reach me, reach out to me. You can email me at contact at golffitnessedge.com. And uh, hey, again, thank you to TPI for putting these great workouts up on the web. Thank you.